I'm going to teach you how you can install Reshade for 5M. So we're going to go to the steps of what you need to do exactly. So please follow along and if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Now, the first thing that we must do is make sure that we have 5M, of course, with GTA installed. Now, if you have that already, then we can open up the Reshade link. So go to the description of the video and there is a link of the Reshade. What this will do is you click on the link and then a download should appear right here. This is the Reshade setup. Now, why is it an older version? Well, in the new versions of 5M, when you will choose a Reshade, so if we go to Reshade, we click on download, it's version 5.9.2. But 5M only accepts 5.8 at this moment. So you're gonna click on the link in the description and download the setup. It should appear right here, or you can go to your file explorer and then go to downloads. Now open up the 5.8.x uh, reshade, and now this should open up. So here you should search for GTA. Now let's say your GTA doesn't find right here. Then here's what you need to do. So locate where you've installed your GTA. That's either on Steam or Epic Games. Now let's say it's on Steam. Go to your library and then GTA. And here right click on your GTA, manage, and then browse local files. Now you know where your GTA is uh, downloaded. And then you can click on browse and then copy this link path and put it in here and then click on uh, enter and then you can click on GTA. Now let's say of Epic Games, then it's basically the same. Just go to Epic Games Launcher. Now go to library, here search for your GTA. Let's say this game is GTA. Click on this dots, go to manage and then go to this folder right here. Now your folder should open up and do exactly the same. So if you've done that, click on next, then select 10, 11, 12, direct X and then you shouldn't have this, but I have this, so I just click on update. And now it should install the reshade on your GTA. So once uh, that's done, click on finish. And now we go to the next step. So now we're going to go to our app data. So either press Windows plus R or search right here. Search for percentage, app data percentage, and then open up this folder. Now click on app data right here. So you should see local. Click on local and then click on 5M. Then click on 5M application data and then go to plugins. Now, in your case, this should be empty. So I will delete my files. And now we need to find our GTA 5. So go back to the folder where you've just found your GTA 5. Now, in my case, it's Steam. So I'll just show you once again. Open up your Steam. And if you have Epic Games, you'll just do it in the way I showed you earlier. Once you have your GTA file, you should see the following. So right there, you should have reset shaders and some other files so what you're going to do is hold down control first of all just click on reshade shaders then hold down control and click on dxgi then you can uh, scroll down and then hold control once again click on reshade.ine and then click on reshade preset so once you've done that you can uh, you can let go of control and then click on copy right here or press ctrl c and then click on paste right here or press ctrl v now now we have the successfully pasted your things right here so you can close both down and now check if your 5m is working so we're going to open up our 5m and when the download is successful it should start up and is successfully install reshade right here you should see 5.8.0 if you press f8 there should be no errors and now you can press the home button on your keyboard in order to uh, start your reshade so here you can download any presets or anything that you would have add-ons just how you would like to use this so i hope this video helped you to install 5m and if it did then please like and subscribe and thank you for watching